So we're over at the hardness tester now. We've loaded up our polished sample. We're indenting it first with 50 grams force, which is set by this module on the top. And we have a dwell time for 15 seconds. So what it does is it applies 15 grams of force on this indenter, holds it for 15 seconds, and then comes out. You can see the tip has come out of contact, so we can now look into this microscope and measure that indent. I can't really get a good image of this on this equipment, but what I'll do is I'll make a few indents and take them over and show you them in a different microscope. All right, I'm over at the optical microscope. I have my sample, it's uh, surface down, so we can see that those indents. I've um, found this uh, surface, found where I indented, um, got this into focus, and now I'm going to switch and send it to the computer. So there's some indents, but things are out of focus. That's okay. That's just uh, the, camper, the camera being at a slightly different focal length. So what I'm going to do is try to center this image. Okay. And now what I can do is take a nice picture of this and then go in on this image and measure the width of the indent in the two different directions. All right, I wanna go in, I've taken this image, I've saved it, I want to measure the, the distance of that dis defines this indent. So what I'm gonna go do is make sure that I calibrate this image in the right way. So I'm choosing the 10X, because that's the microscope uh, lens I'm using. And I also had to choose the resolution of um, image that I took. I'm gonna apply that to image. And now I can go in and draw features on here and measure distances. So for example, I can go and measure horizontally across this feature. And here I'm gonna go and take my two measurements, okay? Now I can play around with this. I can, for example, say that I want more decimal points so I can go and actually get better measurements. And I can go through and do this on all the different indents for all the different annealing uh, temperatures and times.